Hi there everyone, it's Misty here from The Joy Fit Elf. Welcome back to another video. So today I am working with the Quirky Critters again. And I pulled in a couple of other die sets. So I'm using the Swirly Scribbles. This was in last year's annual catalog. I'm pretty sure, um, I'm not pretty sure. I'm sure that I, it's still available. I will link it down below. So out of this, I've used this kind of wavy and then this um, smaller circle. From the occasional catalog last year, we had, or this past spring, we had this Lift Me Up um, bundle, and I used the three smaller clouds from this. And you can probably guess where I'm going with this. <laughs> Maybe you can't. So, for the card today, I'm going to be using this cute little narwhal. I think that's what it's called, right? Narwhal? I'm not sure and we are gonna create a card. So, I'm gonna start by assembling the card because that's honestly going to be the hardest part. So, I have a card base, which is Soft Sky, that measured five and a half by eight and a half, and I cut it at five and a half, scored it at four and a quarter, so eight and a half by 11, cut at five and a half, scored at four and a quarter, holy jeez. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that together. And as you can see, I did a lot of this ahead of time because while it's not really labor intensive, it did take me a hot minute. So, plus this is one of those cards where I'm like, I think I have an idea of what I wanna do, but I can't promise I have an idea of what I wanna do. Okay, so I have a piece that's going on the inside. This is a piece of Whisper White. Measures four by five and a quarter. I'm just gonna slide this on the inside. Again, you can head over to the coordinating blog post, which will be linked down below. If not today, then at some point. And you can find um, a link that says print recipe, and you can go grab this um, recipe that has the measurements, etc. So when I cut this, so I'm gonna make a scene. So this is gonna be our sun. Grab some clouds. Then I want the narwhal in the water. So, or maybe coming out of the water. The water. The water is coming out of the water. So, I'm going to cut this way down. Way down. Like, way, way down. Like, way, way down. Actually, I think I cut it at three. my trimmer in so this may be fantastic or it may be an epic fail you never know with me so I'm gonna cut it down to one and three-fourths I mentioned three-quarters I may regret that choice but we'll see so my, I, my thought was this could go on it and kind of look like waves or like, yeah, like waves or like the sea foam or whatever. And this is in um, Marina Mist. If you hear that bell, that's Roxy who got kicked out of here because she wouldn't stop eating plastic. So there you go. <laughs> So I'll pro I think I'm going to go ahead, let's see, let's see here. I may end up cutting this one in half. So let's go ahead and get this adhered. I'm going to try to use my Tombow.
guys can even see that. But on camera, it you can really see it. And then I'm gonna put this one down flat. I have one extra, but I think I'm gonna leave it. You guys know I like odd numbers. So now, now that we're 15 minutes in, <laughs> let's get to stamping. I'm gonna bring in my Memento Tuxedo Black ink. I've got my little Narwhal stamp. So stinking cute. I'm gonna cut this out or trim around it at least. So perfect. All right, I think I really want the narwhal to pop. Like seriously. So I think I'm going to like watercolor a little gray just to give it a little bit of color, but then I'm going to do the rest um, regular. And I'm gonna watercolor it with my Linka Stella because it's a special narwhal. It's very special. <laughs> Don't know if you saw that epic fail of <laughs> look how dark that came out I haven't used that one in a while so I want to add some more glimmer but I need to take off the red going to cut this out.
I make this worse every time I touch it. Gonna stamp this label and this happy birthday stamp from the Happy Birthday Gorgeous stamp set. I feel like it needs a sentiment and I'm not quite sure what I want it to say. So, happy birthday. It was pretty easy. It's a pretty good one to pick because it's everybody has a birthday can't be alive and not have a birthday, right? Right. So I'm just gonna stamp the label. Gotta make sure I can punch around it. Okay, I'm gonna pull this in front of me so I can see. <laughs>
I think that's it. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for joining me today. I hope you like this series um, and get a little chuckle out of this card. I thought it was really cute. It was really cute in my brain. Hopefully it translated somewhat to paper. But yeah, thanks so much for joining me guys. I will have all of the supplies linked down below along with a link to the coordinating blog post as soon as that goes live. Um, make sure you subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, leave me a comment, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.